been wrapping up this wedding week right now and of course the rings, the dress, everything else included hair, makeup, but you want to feel good, you want to feel good in that dress. Uh, and joining us is Craig Adams from Studio One Personal Trainer. Great to have you here. Uh, and so of course you deal with a lot of clients, especially some that are looking to get ready for their wedding. But overall, what is your business really about? My business is really about dealing with people for their goals, so weight loss, muscle gain, whatever it has to be, but then also addressing them so that they can actually become better people, right? become a better person. You have a, an interesting program. It's called what, the Human Side? Yeah, or the Human Side program. Break us through because I love this concept because really this is what you want at the end of the day. This is like a life, like your life changing kind of thing. Totally. So I still offer regular personal training sessions for people that want to get in shape. But the Human Side program is addressing people and addressing fitness and wellness on a more human side. So if someone wants to lose 30 pounds, that's great. I want to help them that, help achieve that goal. How can I help them keep it off? And by helping them keep it off, I'm trying to address the mental, emotional, you know, all that baggage that we carry with us and the damage from when we're young to you know sort of alleviate that. Or why did they gain that 30 pounds in why the first place or how did that happen? You got it. And do you find it's an interesting progression as to how you might be approaching things different if you're just there to kind of say, okay, this is what we have to do. You want to lose your 10 pounds or this is how you're going to lose the 10 pounds and keep it off the it's, whole time. It's, it's very interesting because when I deal with people every day, I still treat them the same way that I do in the Human Side program. The Human Side program is actually you and I making a commitment to each other to improve you in many different levels. So it's not something that can happen in the six weeks to get your bikini body. It's a little bit longer. It could be a nine to 12 month process because we all have a lot of things going on in our life. Stress, you know, weddings coming mm -hmm. up, all those things that really affect us and not just affect us in our bodies, affect us in our mind as well. Okay, you did mention kind of like the six week bikini body, which yeah. would be great for so many people as the weather's getting nice. We could do that for the for the wedding dress. Certainly, so certainly. you have to, and we were talking to you, a lot of the wedding dresses, it's the upper body that you're really trying to target because a lot of the rest of it is covered at least for the dress for that day. That's right. So you had a couple of things that you want to show, so maybe brides that are kind of getting ready for that. Sure, so I have a, I have a little circuit that people can do at home or a woman person can do at home that's very quick. And you can do it with light weights, three pounds, five pounds. You want to use light weights because they're going to go really high repetitions. Okay. So the exercises are very simple. People are used to them. So I usually like to start out right with a shoulder press. So just palms forward are coming right up. And you're going to count out 10 repetitions. After 10 repetitions, you're going to bring them down, go right into a front raise. So we're still hitting those shoulders, hitting across the traps where your back's working, and then we're going to come right into a side lateral afterwards. Again, still going for 10 repetitions. Your arms are going to be tired. They're going to be burning. So now we're going to throw a little bit of legs into it so the legs can help to power up those shoulders. So we'll go into a squat and into 10 more and then same thing into the front and by doing this combination we can work lower body and upper body give us that extra repetition that we need to burn some extra calories and get the core involved by doing some squats how are you incorporating that i mean i got that with the shoulder press sure. what's happening when you're doing the front and the side raises okay so when i'm doing front and side raises because the shoulder has several different heads we want to make sure we hit it equally front to back so when i go for a front raise i'm trying to really work right across the top of the chest and shoulders as that front raise gets very hard because i'm beginning fatigued then i throw the legs into it to try and get 10 more repetitions so now okay, so you're it, my full glutes on are working, squat, my everything. hands are working, and quads. So the full squat, let me see. Let's go for it. Okay. Okay. So you're going to start with a regular shoulder press. Yes. So palms forward, coming straight up. So, so you're going to do, do 10 of these, and right. once you hit 10, you're so going to be tired. Nine, you're 10. Got it, 10, then we're going to go right into a front straight you got forward. It, right into a front raise. Now, same do thing. you like to rotate or are you going straight? I like to rotate. Okay. You can do palms in. That's mm -hmm. perfectly fine. It's still a great exercise. And then after that, we'll go 10 for side laterals. So now we're working out to the side. You've got it. Again, still hitting the traps, side delt. And now that your arms are okay. tired, you've done 30 repetitions. Back over top. And this one we're going to do we squats. Another I know you have high heels on squats. Press okay. it in. I want to try the, okay, wait, this one. So the front raise, so you're going to squat. You got it. So and now you're generating power thing. from lower body to upper body. And we're really working the body as a unit versus, in, is, as, versus individual muscle groups. All right, so someone's got six, uh, their wedding six weeks out. Mm -hmm. Taking a nice light paint. We're looking at five pounds right now. These are five pounders, yeah. Uh, and we and can do this several times a week because it's not really taxing on the muscles from a standpoint. It won't really tear them down as much as you'll continue to tone and continue to burn as many calories as possible. So it's a quick little workout you could do virtually every day. Perfect. Great tips. And of course, you can find more information at Studio One Personal Training. StudioOnePT.com. StudioOnePT.com. And, it. uh, and you're located right in New Edinburgh. Right. Yep. Congratulations. Thank you.